Yo, this is Donald Williams here with Smart Move Fitness downtown at the Armory, getting ready for Legacy 38. We have Baron Lewis. Uh, Lewis, uh, how was your uh, your travels from uh, New Mexico to uh, Minnesota? Uh, honestly, my, uh, my travels, this is probably the smoothest travel I had. Coming from New Mexico to Minnesota, I expected it to be a little rough. The flights were short, surprisingly good. You know, my brother came through and my two coaches came with me the same, you know, the same day Wednesday. And uh, we pretty much been kicking it, having fun and just going through the motions, enjoying the process. Nice. So uh, how does it feel to be on this uh, huge card with uh, Jeff Hughes versus uh, Green Legacy 38? Uh, how does it feel to be on a huge card for Legacy? Man, this venue, though. You know, the venue is lit. I'm not going to lie. The venue is pretty good. And then being on the Legacy card and finally being on TV, like they're, they're, they're live, seeing so people can see, well, they can experience what I'm going, you know, what we're going through. And they're going to see, oh, this kid is actually good. And it's just another business opportunity, another career opportunity to, further, you know, to get further on in what I'm doing. So, yeah, it feels good to be on this Legacy card and especially at co-main event. So. Nice. And you're currently 4 and 0, so you get this out the way, you'll be 5 and 0. Uh, who are you uh, actually uh, fighting tomorrow night? I'm fighting Colin Huckbody. I, I believe he's from here. I'm not too sure, but uh, uh, Colin Huckbody, we just looking to. I mean, we're looking to stop him, looking to finish him. Not, yeah, that's man. In the fight game, we are looking to stop the fight. We are looking to finish these guys. So I'm not gonna lie and sit here. We're looking forward to getting up and down. I'm actually looking forward to enjoying myself during the fight, but being more, being very efficient. You know, executing the plans properly. No plan actually. Just we're gonna fight Colin Huckbody. We're gonna give a. I'm gonna give a good show. Nice. So how did your uh, camp go? Uh, and how long was your camp? So I have a younger brother, LeVon Lewis, just had his pro debut not too long ago. I was helping, it initially started with me helping other fighters, and then I got the call, had my brother's fight, went to that, and then I just did a, it was a pretty long camp, but I feel like with other distractions, when you're helping other fighters and when you have your home life, and then when you, you know, the hard work is always going to be, it's always there, it's the must, it's the consistency that I kept up with. So it's been a rocky camp, but at the same time, it's probably been one of the better ones I've ever had. So you say you had a pretty uh, good camp, and uh, outside of that, is there anybody uh, that you want to thank uh, tomorrow night for uh, for this fight? Oh, of course, man. Um, first and foremost, you know, we got we got God. You know, we, a lot of people, I don't know who a lot of people believe in, but for me, I'm going to thank God I wouldn't be here. Um, you know, my free will to be able to come here and do this. So second of all, I want to thank my family back home in Atlanta. You know, pops, moms, sisters, brothers. Uh, and then back at Jackson Wink in New Mexico, we got all the coaches. Every single coach has put time into me. But my mains, Coach Winklejohn and my main Joey Villasenor, my main Harry St. Ledger, they all helped me. They helped me grow. They watched me. They honest with me, gave me good feedback. And I am here right now because not only myself, but because of the help. And people being staying consistent with me you know obviously they see something and I'm starting to learn that there is something and I'm actually starting to see it myself so I'm confident let's go nice confident tomorrow night on legacy 38